Now, I hope everyone's doing great today because this day is very great that I will be giving you the most talk about and most interesting topics in the crypto world. Are you ready? Okay, stay tuned. Now for today's news, this is brought to us by PCN or Preferred Currency News. Um, here. New York awards first ever bit license to Bitcoin ATM company. Okay. Now Bitcoin Teller Machine or they call BTM operator coin source has just become the 12th crypto company to receive a license from the New York State Department of Financial Services. The firm announced approval of the so-called bit license on Thursday with the firm's general counsel Arnold Spencer noting that it was the first granted to a Bitcoin ATM provider to date. The company already has 40 BTMs in the state, having been operating under a provisional license pending full approval. In a statement, NYDFS Superintendent Maria Volu confirmed the news, saying the license approval is a further step implementing strong regulatory safeguards and effective risk-based controls while encouraging the responsible growth of financial innovations. So receiving the bid license, Spencer told Coindesk, is a validation of our business mode and compliance mo uh, model. So he explained, it's been a long involved process. The initial application was in 2015 and since then, what we've seen is a great deal of diligence on NYDF's part, really pushing us to both explain and in some cases improve our policies and procedures. These range from having a business disaster continuity plan to state-of-the-art cybersecurity measures Spencer indicated. During the evaluation period, CoinSource grew from being an audited firm with three employees and a handful of BTMs to being fully audited and growing to more than 20 employees and over 200 machines. Now, we've had 500% growth over three consecutive years in terms of machines and we've had comparable growth in revenue until spring of 2018. Wow, congratulations. When it slowed down substantially, he said, compared with traditional exchanges, the firm's BTMs are convenient and offer direct peer-to-peer -peer transactions, Spencer said, adding, we do our account opening and compliance in real time. The machine speed comes from a per, uh, propriety system that CoinSource developed to conduct. I know your customer checked where a customer would have to send a crypto exchange bag details and other proof of identification. CoinSource only needs a driver's license, a selfie, and a cell phone number. CoinSource also makes it easier for unbanked individuals to access cryptocurrencies, Spencer said as they do not need to possess a bank account to purchase Bitcoin and can pay with cash. Wow, this is a really good option for those who doesn't have or any bank or unbanked individuals. Okay, going forward, at present, coin source customers can only buy or sell Bitcoin through the BTMs. They can't actually send funds to other wallets yet. So Spencer explained that this is by design as allowing that would be facilitating money transmission. Transmission. So you have to have a money transmission license in both jurisdictions where you're starting the transaction and where you're ending the transaction. However, guys, the company currently has money transmission licenses in 18 states with pending license in another 15. Okay, Spencer anticipates that by some time next year, CoinSource will have the license in all 50 states. We hope for that. At the point in time, we'll be in a position to have people deposit cash into machines and transfer Bitcoin into a third-party wallet, provided both customers were registered, he said. Outside of the U.S., CoinSource plans to expand operations potentially to Japan, South Africa, and Puerto Rico. Now, of these, 
Puerto Rico is likely to happen first, with the company already having a money transmitting license for the territory. We have had preliminary discussions with regulators in Japan to use that as a springboard for Asia, and we've had initial conversations with bankers and regulators in South Africa, but that's probably the furthest out in terms of development, Spencer said. Further, being incorporated in Argentina, CoinSource already has a base for Latin and South American expansion. Wow, getting bigger and bigger, expanding, guys. Now, the addition of cryptocurrencies other than Bitcoin across all the firm's machines is also on the cards in the near future. But that's contingent, uh, contingent of course, on regulatory approval, he said. Right. So, guys, that is the most intriguing, that is the most talk about topic. I, now, I don't wonder why, because it's really a good article, right? So, guys, if you want to have more of these um, articles and news, please visit PCN or preferredcurrency.news, all right? Now, if you want to be an affiliate, you can just click the affiliate button, and then it will take you to this page. It says, this is the affiliate section of Preferred Currency News. If you are an existing affiliate, please log in to access your control panel. And if you are not, but wish to become one, you will need to apply. So to apply, guys, you must be a registered user on this side. If you have an existing account on this side, please log in. If not, please register. All right? So, um, guys, again, visit preferredcurrency.news. And then be the first one to get notified of the new updates. All right. So if you will be subscribing to Preferred Currency News, then we can have a lot of information for you. All right. Now let's see what. Oh, by the way, here are other videos that is available on the website. You can just check um, one of these videos or more. Just by clicking one of these and then it will take you to the right channel here on YouTube and if you want to contact the man behind Preferred Currency News you can contact Donald Lewis or Donald DeGru and his contact details are in, um, available on the website all right or for easy access or for easy um, for in order for us to be convenient you can message him directly your name and your email is required and then your message and just hit send all right so guys let me give you a glimpse all right a glimpse of what will you be having or what will you be getting if you subscribe to us all right first you will be getting a newsletter a newsletter each and every day that's why email that's 12 hours before we upload videos here in YouTube so you can have all the information that you need every day and be updated that easy you can just sit you can just stay home and relax have your coffee or whatever you're doing just check your email and we will update you yes you're correct this newsletter um, on the first part you can see all the articles of the day not just one but a lot here here we can see one two and three and by the way, guys, please join our Telegram group to get the latest updates on EOS, okay? And enjoy talking with us. All right. And on the newsletter, guys, there are a lot of um, websites also that you can visit for your reference. And I know that th these websites can help you with your research or can also notify you if what is the best website for you to add your listings, to place your additional listings. Now, if you wish to become a web subscriber, then visit Preferred Currency News. Right. Okay. And guys, let me introduce you the Donald's research list. For me, this is the most important part of the newsletter because, here, let me show you. This is the spreadsheet. This is the Donald's research list. And by the way, I will show you a secret. I will tell you rather a secret. This Donald spreadsheet or Donald's research list cannot be found anywhere else on the internet but only here at Preferred Currency News. Now, what is Donald's research list?
guys, Donald's research list is a spreadsheet telling or giving you um, every information that you need in order for you to keep track of your tokens and coins. Okay, let me show you. For example, on this first column right here, <clears throat> this is the names of the tokens and coins. These are the name and to of the tokens and coins. All right, you just need to find, if you're using a computer, it will be easy to access because this is a spreadsheet so we can just simply control F, all right? And then type the name of your preferred token or coin, all right? So, for example, today, Bitcoin show is showing the best news because um, every token have their um, colors. Red have negative news, orange or tan are neutral, yellow are fair, green have good news, and blue are showing the best news. So let me give you an example, all right? Bitcoin, as of today, um, November 4, 2018, Bitcoin's USD recent price is 6,350.32, Share of total market volume, not capital, is 34.61%. Google searches compared to the past seven days, it's 49%. Um, it's crossing down 50. Uh, number of positive technical indicators, it's three. 24 hours current volume versus price, zero. Seven days weekly volume versus price, 6.88. 30 days monthly volume versus price, 4.76. Percent issued, it's 82.66, all right? So, um, let's find another one. Let's just say EOS, okay. So EOS is also showing the best news for today. <clears throat> Excuse me. USD recent price for EOS is 5.33. Um, share of total market volume, 5. 0.67%. Google searches compared to the past seven days, it's 88%. It's crossing down 50. Um, number of positive technical indicators, three. 24 hours current volume versus price, a zero. Seven days weekly volume versus price, it's 48.74. 30 days monthly volume versus price, it's 4.16. And percent issued, it's 90.06%. And last, um, let's say, hmm, DAV, all right. Oh, see, DAV is also showing the best news, guys. So DAV token, USD recent price, it's 0, 0.00. Share of total market volume, 0%. Google searches, 0%. It's crossing up 50. Number of positive technical indicators, none, and 24 hours current ver current volume versus price, zero. Seven days weekly volume versus price, it's 6.54. And 30 days monthly volume versus price, zero. And percent issued is 32.94%, all right? So guys, again, this sheet is not a recommendation to buy or sell anything or any token or crypto, okay? You must research each one for yourself. Each one yourself, all right? So guys, this is just a sample, okay? There are a lot of tokens and coins. So you can, you can, you can subscribe to preferredcurrency.news and you can have the luxury of having this information every day. And you can have a copy of the Donald's research list okay if you subscribe and then you can compare it right you can compare it to the past and let's see for the future all right very convenient very easy to access because we will be the one who will notify you via email so you just need to oh there's the email for today meaning i will be updated of the current news and updates and what's the talk about what's the most intriguing topic for today what is the status of my token or coins for today? Should I invest more? Uh, should I stop investing this time? Should I transfer to another token or coin, right? So um, it's very easy for us to answer 
those questions if we subscribe to preferredcurrency.news. How? You have two options. You can use your preferred method. You can use your PayPal for a monthly recurring for only $15 per month yet. Just click this link. Or you can use the Coinbase option for $180 annual subscription. That's to be paid with your favorite crypto. So guys, what are you waiting for? This is Preferred Currency Don News and subscribe now. Yes. All right. So guys, that's the latest news and update for today. But before I go, I just want to remind everyone that we are not financial advisors. All right. We are just here to give you the latest news and updates and help you with your research. But it is really important for you to do your own research and then you can decide for yourself. All right. So guys, again, this has been Alex. Thank you so much for watching this video. Please don't forget to subscribe. And if you like, you can leave a, co you can leave a comment on the comment section below. For more videos to come, I hope to see you. Bye.